Good morning, y'all. So here we are. Um, I literally just woke up this morning. Um, and today we are 11 days out from my pro debut. I literally cannot believe that uh, we're here already. Like, this prep has been pretty freaking smooth. Um, towards the end, obviously, like, these are my last, like, low days. So, like, I have been feeling, I'm not going to lie, like, my energy has, like, tanked. Like, it tanks in the middle of the day. But, anyways, let's get on with today. So, I've already, I woke up, I already, um... Did my check-in with my coach. I hit a new prep load today. So today I was sitting at about 115. Um, point six or point eight, something like that. That is a new prep low for me. Um, the last time I weighed about that was actually when I turned pro, the day that I turned pro, that's how much I woke up at after you know we depleted and everything like that. So um, this is a new prep low for me. Um, pretty excited and today we are having a high caloric day so I get more food today and we're also resting so I'm not training and I get more food um, so I'm super freaking flat this morning and uh, we're right on track and right where we need to be um, and now we're going to fill out a little bit today and maybe a little bit more tomorrow, depending on what I look like. Um, but today we have a rest day and a high calorie day. So I'm going to take you through a typical rest day with me. Um, and then I will also show you what I'm eating on my high calorie day today because I'm super excited. And yeah i get a lot of questions on full day of eatings and stuff so let's get to it today on the agenda um we're about to go knock out some incline treadmill for fasted cardio today um and that's all i have um plus some steps that i will make sure that i get throughout the day um, but for today we're gonna go knock out this cardio um and then we're gonna come back and then we have um, work and a bunch of stuff to do around the house um, and then we will go do uh, physical therapy I have that today as well and I have deep tissue work as well um, this evening so um, like I said I'm about 11 days out so we really don't want to do any body work any closer to show than this um, just because we don't want to risk any inflammation um, you know, come show day. So today we're getting all fixed up and we're eating some carbs. So this is like the first taste of what we'll get when we get to, um, when we get to peak week, um, when all the fun happens and we get to eat a lot more. So we'll feed today and rest today, maybe feed tomorrow. Um, I'll be training tomorrow and then, um, from there, it's really just a lot of low days and like flattening back out before we start filling out again um, for the look that we're gonna bring to stage. doing incline treadmill nothing crazy just 30 minutes and I also managed to knock out like half of my step count for the day which is perfect because I have you know just small errands to run um, you know with the body work and whatnot but I really want to rest today so I want to stay off my feet as much as possible and kind of just chill and you know, I'll be working and stuff, but yeah. Um, before I eat, I'm going to take some of my fast supplements and I'll walk you through what I'm taking right now. And I'm going to take those while I cook my food. Um, so before I uh, did cardio, I took some Yohimbine and I took that fasted. And now I'm going to take 
some thyroid support. I'm also going to take some Tudka and some Dim. And I'm taking, that's it. I'm taking all of those fasted and I'm going to take those now and then I'm going to eat and then I'll eat the, I'll have some more health supplements um, with my meal. Um, so yeah. What are you doing? Why are you on the counter? Bagheera? What doing? <laughs> Sometimes he likes to sit in my bar stools. Alright, so even though this is a high day, um, I'm still eating pretty much like the same foods that I was eating on like my low or my base days. I just get more of them. <laughs> Um, which frankly is very exciting. So, you know what? I've just been doing organic blueberries because literally blueberries are freaking $10 a pack. And I eat way too many berries for that to be fiscally feasible. So we're going with organic blueberries. So I want to make sure that, you know, there's nothing that's going to risk bloating or any like distension of the belly. Not that I like really have, um, you know, issues with that in general, but like, I just don't want, um, to risk it. There's nothing that I would not do right now to not risk, um, or to, how do I say, <laughs> what am I trying to say? Um, there's nothing I wouldn't do right now to minimize any risk of anything that we don't want on show day, right? Like we want to keep our waist as tight as possible. So I want to make sure that I'm doing the things to keep, you know, those goals intact when we get to stage. So I'm really only doing like 50 grams of leafy greens. And then I threw in some diced tomatoes, which I have been having my whole prep. I don't have any issues with them. Um, and I know how I respond to them. I've also had them in previous preps and all of that. So nothing new there. Um, along with egg whites and one whole egg. Um, and that's what I'm going to have for my protein source. And then, um, I'm actually going to have oatmeal, which is what I normally have, even on, you know, my low days. Um, but I get more of it. And then I'm also going to add some berries to uh, my oats as well. Um, sometimes I eat my frozen berries separately just because I like want to eat. So I eat everything separately, if that makes sense. So rather than like throwing my berries into my oatmeal, I will literally just like eat them on the side because it's like a breakfast dessert. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, and then we're going to chill and work for a little bit while we eat this meal and I'm going to finish cooking this. to eat this meal and then do some work on the computer. So here we go. Here's my meal. I'm going to eat that and I'm going to knock out some work for a few hours and kind of just chill and put my feet up <clears throat> um, and let this meal digest. And then I'll do some posing practice later and then we'll go and hit all of our appointments and uh, finish out the day with the rest of our food and we'll even do some 
we'll probably answer some questions along the way. So, um, yeah, I'm going to get to work and I'm going to get eaten and that's meal one. <clears throat> okay, so I just finished my meal um, and I told y'all I would share with you the supplements that I take with my food. Um, I already shared what I take fasted, so I'm actually going to take two caps oops, um, of lipid from Revive. I'm also going to take a cap of Omega from Revive. And then I'm going to have two caps of Women's Health from Revive. One cap NAC, and then I'm going to do vitamin D3 and one cap of vitamin uh, K2. And that is what I am taking with my first meal. Um, I just did some posing practice. I let my first meal digest for a little bit while I worked. Um, and then I did some of that. And then now it's time to uh, make my second meal of the day. Um, if I was training, this would be like my pre-workout meal. But I'm not training today. Um, we are getting ready to go to physical therapy though um, and get final tune-ups before showtime. So I'm going to make this meal and then honestly I'm going to bring it on the road with me and we're going to skedaddle um, and go make this appointment and uh, from there we will um, move on to our third meal and uh, deep tissue work later on today. So let's knock this out um, and then yeah. Let's go. <laughs> so I honestly get a ton of questions on how I make my chicken for some reason. I did break that down in my last video. So if you haven't checked that out, go check out that video. Um, but this is pre-cooked chicken. I cooked this in the crock pot. Um, and then I'm just going to pan heat it with some cocoa aminos. And then I'm going to throw it on top of some rice with some pink salt. And my staples like these are literally my prep staples condiments and stuff that I use literally all throughout prep these are my staples <laughs> and these have been my staples probably for the last like four or five years <laughs> so um, once you find what works and that you like it like stick with it so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and heat this chicken up in the pan with some coconut aminos this is plain plain chicken that I put in the crock pot and then shredded it up. Um, so I'm going to do that and then we got to go. And really quick before I run out the door because I have to go, um, I'm going to talk about supplements because we are talking about them in this video and I mentioned them in my first meal so I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to go ahead and take two caps of Revive Lipid. I'm going to take one cap of Revive Omega and then I'm going to take two caps women's health from revive and i'm going to take another cap of nac from revive as well so i do have a code you guys if you need supplements um it will save you some money at checkout but it will also uh, support me at the same time so um it's just my name my first name aria um a-r-i-a -A, at checkout so um yeah those are the revive supplements i'm taking with this meal and now we gotta go <laughs> All right, y'all, so I have been back for a few hours and I've just been working, um, but now it's time for our third meal on our high calorie rest day. Um, so after I eat this, I like totally forgot what I was saying for a second. Um, so after I eat this, we are gonna go get some deep tissue work done and then we'll come back and finish out our last two meals for the day. Um, but right now what I'm eating is we've just got some egg whites and I threw in some diced uh, tomatoes. I'm a little scared to fully, I don't want to drop it. But uh, we added some diced tomatoes and we added in some pepper and pink salt, of course. And I already know that we threw on some sriracha and reduced sugar ketchup. <laughs> So that's our protein for this meal. And then I also have 75 grams of uh, banana and then some rice cakes. So um, I ate my last meal on the go. Uh, well, 
when I was going to PT work, um, I don't really like to do that. I like to like focus on eating first, <laughs> um, usually, but sometimes you got to do what you got to do. So, um, I have a little bit of time right now. I'm going to relax, put my feet up and chill, um, and do a little bit of computer work, but you know, nothing stressful and just kind of like rest and chill. Um, and then while I eat this and then we'll, um, get ready and head out to deep tissue work and that will uh, make sure that we are all ready for show day and my body is fine-tuned and muscles are sitting where we want them and all of that fun stuff um, without risking inflammation um, or any like bruising to the muscle or anything like that so that's what I'm gonna do. Um, after deep tissue work, we're gonna finish out our steps. I've got a treadmill here, so um, we're just gonna finish that out here at the house. Um, so that way for the last couple meals, we can just do absolutely nothing and be fully sedentary right before we go to bed. And then we'll check in tomorrow morning with coach and be really well rested. Um, hopefully looking a little bit fuller, but hopefully not too full so I can have another high day. Um, but you know, Either way, no matter what happens, we're gonna look, we're gonna do what's best for the look, and here we go. I'm gonna get on with it. All right, y'all. So, this is my next meal. This is my second to last meal um, of the day. This is one of my favorite meals. I have rice, avocado, um, that is just ketchup and sriracha right there, and this is beef with. Um, green beans, diced tomatoes, and I cooked all of that in um, coconut aminos, and then I put pink salt on top. So I can't wait to eat this. This is one of my favorite meals. I'm going to eat it now. Okay, y'all. So I am getting ready to make my last meal, but I just wanted to walk you through <laughs> what I'm doing for this meal. Um, so in this bowl right here is literally like whey and uh, ch uh, chia seeds with almond butter, organic almond butter. And I make it into like a little like sludge pasty. And then I'm gonna throw this in the freezer while I make and eat my cream of rice that I'm going, I have pre-measured. I literally just use regular ass cream of rice. I'm gonna throw this in the microwave, make this real quick, and then I'm gonna throw in cinnamon, stevia, and pink salt um, on top, and that's how I'm gonna eat my cream of rice. And then when I, after I eat that, I'm going to throw some of my berries on top of my whey paste, and I'm gonna eat it like a little protein sludge dessert, so. Just wanted to walk you through that. Um, I'm probably just gonna honestly eat this meal and hit the hay because I am ready to eat and sleep. So that's my goal for the rest of the night. And this is a really nice meal to eat right before I go to bed. So I'll look nice and full in the morning probably.